Thank you for purchasing Time Passages. In this video tutorial, we are going to walk you through how to download and install Time Passages software onto your Windows computer and enable your codes. Before we begin, you want to make sure you have stable internet connection to download the software. Also, be sure to close any tabs or other applications you have open for best result. If you have already downloaded the demo version from our website, you will just need to enable the codes. You can either follow the instructions in the email we sent you or wait until later in this video when we talk about enabling codes. First, go to your email account and you should have received a Time Passages Enabling Codes email from Astrograph that looks like this. We are going to walk you through how to download and install the software step by step. Let's start with the first one, Download. Click this download link, which will bring you to our downloads landing page. Our website should have already identified the correct operating system. If not, please select Time Passages for Windows 8 and above. Let's pause here. You will need Windows 8 or above for this program to work. If you're not sure which Windows operating system you currently have, this is how you would check. Bring your mouse to the bottom search bar right here. Type about your PC. Click on about your PC and it should bring you to this window. If you do not see which operating system you have here, it might be located under systems info, so go ahead and click that. As you can see, I have Windows 10. If you do not have Windows 8 or above, the software will not work, so please pause this video and go update your OS and come back to this tutorial. If you have 8 or above, we can continue. We no longer need this window, so go ahead and close this. We can close this as well. And we're back here on the download page. Enter your email right here. And click the blue download now button. The download should start automatically. If your download does not start automatically, click right here to manually start it. Depending on how fast your Wi-Fi is, it will take several minutes. If your download is still not working, try using a different web browser. Currently, I am using Google Chrome. You can try a different browser such as Firefox or Internet Explorer, which may help. It looks like my download is complete. Open the file. And you should see the Time Passages install folder open up. Follow the prompts and hit next to complete the installation process. Here, click on I accept the terms in the license agreement and click next. Then the installation wizard will ask you where you want to save the software. You can choose the default setting. Please make sure that software files do not get saved on your OneDrive if you have that activated. And then click install. Once you choose where to save the files, continue to follow the prompts to complete the installation. You will see a window pop up asking if you want to allow this unknown publisher to make changes to your device. And click yes. And then here on this window, go ahead and click Finish. You will see a dialog box that says Welcome to Time Passages with the option to enter code or use the trial demo. Click Enter Code. Now you will see that you have to select Standard, Basic, or Advanced. If you forgot which one you bought, refer back to your enabling code email. You can go back to your email by going to the bottom, clicking on the Google Chrome, and selecting the right window. So I'm going to scroll down to number three, and where I have the enabling codes. I can see my name, the serial number, and below the serial number, it will let you know which version you purchased. I bought the complete package which came with advanced edition and four add-on codes. So I will have to enter all these codes. 
First, I need to select the right edition. Now you will see a dialog box with three boxes. And we're going to first enter our name, serial number, and our enable code. When entering your enabling codes, we highly recommend that you copy and paste as it appears without any spaces before or after. The codes are very finicky and you want to copy and paste the exact code. So we will start off with your name first. Take your mouse, go back to your email, highlight your name, make sure there's no spaces before or after, and on your keyboard press Control c to copy or come over to the right here, click on the three dots, scroll down, and click on copy. We're going to go back to Time Passages software. We do that by bringing your mouse over to the bottom, clicking on the purple icon, and here we will get to paste it. You can do it on your keyboard, control V, like Victor, or right click and select paste. Now we will have to copy the serial number. Go back to your email, select your serial number, and copy. Select time passages, the purple icon on the bottom, Paste your serial number here, and we will do it one more time with the enable codes. Go back to your email, select your enable code, copy, click on the time passages purple icon, and paste your enable code here. If you see an error message problem with code, you did not enter the code correctly. Most likely an extra space snuck in, so go back and try again to enter each code perfectly and carefully. And make sure you copy the enable code of the addition you purchased and not the add-on code. If you see this success with code message, congratulations, you did it. Go ahead and click OK, and you will see a quick start guide. You can read it later. Click OK for now, and you will see Edgar Casey's chart pop up. This is a sample chart. So click OK, and if you have add-on codes, we're going to continue on to input the add-on enabling codes. First, we want to click on X, the small X right here, not the big one, the small one on Edgar Casey's chart. Go ahead and click Enable from the menu and scroll down to enabling features and select the add-on that you wish to enter. So on this one I'm going to go ahead and insert my compatibility add-on code. So your name and serial number should already be there and we will have to go back to the email to copy and paste the enable code for the compatibility add-on. So go back to your email, find your compatibility add-on code Select, highlight it, and copy it. And go back to the purple icon, time passages icon, and paste it in the box. And click OK. Congratulations for inputting your first add-on code. If you have more add-ons to enable, you know how to enable them. Well, I bet you are ready to start playing around with your new software. I have two more things to show you and then I will let you enjoy your new program. First, I want to show you how to access the software manual. Here in the toolbar, scroll up and go click on Help. You will then scroll down to click on See Manual. Select how you want to open this file. I'm going to select Google Chrome. And here in the PDF format, we have the time passages Astrology Software User Manual with a lot of detailed information that you can go in and read. Second, I want to show you how to create a new chart. So go back to the purple icon and go to File and click on New to start creating your first chart. Put in the birth date, time, location. If you are not sure of the birth time, you can just select Sunrise Chart over here. After you have entered your information, click on OK, 
and you should have your first natal chart. Congratulations on your new purchase and getting everything up and running. Enjoy and have so much fun.